Boonsung Rec Dive Briefing Welcome to the Boonsung Rec. The first important part of diving is finding the wreckage. There are several mooring lines attached to the wreck and you must use them. If you do a free descent with nothing in sight, you can get lost quite quickly. Descend the line until you can see the wreckage, then keep it in sight throughout your dive. Orientation is easy as long as you stay nearby. As you descend, you will likely be greeted by huge schools of snappers, fusiliers and barracudas. Spend some time swimming inside this fish soup. <laughs> After a few minutes, make your way to the bottom and begin your dive around the wreck itself. The best way to move is and follow it clockwise, or counterclockwise. So that your dive ends where you started. Swimming slowly will take you around the wreckage in about 45 minutes. If you have two dives on this site, do not hesitate to slow down your pace. You will have a better chance to discover the different nudibranchs and macrofauna hidden in all the little nooks and crannies. Do not enter the wreck at any time. As its structure is very weak and unstable, this could be dangerous. Diver on the Boonsung Wreck, Khao Lok Thailand Pay attention to your buoyancy and watch where you land your fins. In addition to the old rusty metal which can be considered a source of danger, this site contains a large quantity of lionfish and scorpion fish. Also try to avoid swimming too close to the bottom. This could lift a large amount of sand, which will <laughs> drastically reduce visibility. One of the best parts of the dive site is known locally as Nudibranch Hotel. This large section to the northeast is home to dozens of species of sea slugs and nudibranchs. However, you will need to have a keen eye. Most of them are brightly colored. But some are very well camouflaged on the rusty metal. A nudibranch enthusiast can spend all his diving on this part of the Boonsung wreck. Finally, end your dive by swimming one last time in the huge schools of fish, they are really impressive. Then, move away from the wreckage to make your safety stop and be sure to use a surface parachute. The site can sometimes be loaded with boats between cruises and day trips from Bongsok Beach. Boonsung Wreck Route descend along the southern mooring line until you see the X-shaped metal structure. Begin your dive clockwise. Boonsung Rec Itinerary Swim slowly and look inside every nook and cranny for macro wildlife. Compass Cap Rec Boonsung Compass Cap. Use this compass heading to travel from the mooring line to the northwest end of the artificial reef. End your dive in the same place you started it. If your boat is attached to the line make your safety stop here. Otherwise, you can do it in the blue.